What's up everybody, Drift Studio no. here to bring some more my NBA 2K15. Now, for those of you who had seen my previous supercar video, I did have a car pack opening. And I thought I might as well have a car pack opening for the NBA 2. Just because you guys deserve it. So, we'll see how much is it in just a sec once we hit in the quick game but let's check out my season as you guys can tell I am 31 and 0 and I'm doing pretty good I'm staying on top of um, like every three games I usually energize my team or sometimes when I uh, have a weak opponent next or know that he's not gonna or know he's not gonna be active I'll just um, use my energies on my five starters and the backup just leave them how they are and then like sooner or later I'll just give them the energies of the backups and mostly the whole team so from according to the standings we are at first place and we should be ahead of second place by eight wins so you guys can tell by the losses how much I'm, I'm an advantage and so far there's like I don't think there's nobody else that could compete with me as far as um staying active but from the cards wise I don't know yet because I haven't faced somebody that's like um actually fully energized on me I don't know why I guess they're not seeing my record that I'm actually undefeated so it's kind of surprised that I'm still Still undefeated and nobody has been like uh, fully energized. I was pretty scared that somebody might would just because they seen my record, but yeah, I guess not. But hopefully throughout the night, I do maintain this record till the morning. So let's just do the um car pack opening and might as well get two more picks extra at it. So let's go to the quick game and let's get us a match. So, so far we should have around, I think I might save it, save it as a price for you guys after this match just to see how much I have. And the good thing about this game is every time, well, basically, I do the same old routine method where you, um, you know every time you win a match or lose a, after the match basically you just close the app and we open the app again and all it would do is just save two picks for you instead of forcing you to have to select them so just by repeating that process you'll just end up saving picks and picks but yeah most of you know already and yeah, the good thing I like about the NBA when you say your picks is, is um it gives you energies as well. Cause sometimes in SuperCard, um, well now that it gives ten energies, it's gonna be easier to save picks now, just because I can use five energies in one game, and throughout the day when I'm saving picks, I'll still have five extra energies, so I don't really have to waste on my card picks. But yeah, on the NBA, I kind of like it because, you know, it gives you energy. So you don't really have to force to pick up cars in order to get um extra energies. So as you can tell, we get an energy and we do have a 62 car pick opening or draft pick, I may say, for the NBA. So let's start from here. Hopefully on this uh, pack opening. I hopefully I do pull an ultra rare at least an ultra rare that I already have so I can pro would be nice but let's see how it goes all right so we do pick up an uncommon we pick a common Chris Copeland and then we get that common good timing all right here's the first rare we get Howard Isley. Nice. 
and we reach the car limit. So let's proceed. Let's go back. And usually I would combine my cards and start another game, but you know, since we have a pack opening, I'm not gonna do that. It would just be a waste of time. I just I usually do that in my free time. So let's go to manage seasons. And I noticed that Paul Pierce is a small forward. And I think my ultra rare card is a small forward as well. So I might be, I might be replacing him if I am correct. But if I'm not, then I'll try to see what works if he works better or yeah I have to check it out I still can uh, talk talk more about it so let's train him up with some uncommons now all right let's get all these guys out of here Right, let's get CJ Miles, Tony, the hot hand, train all those up. Which I'll get Paul Pierce in a good level 20. And yeah, I do apologize if my if my voice sounds tired. It is late night already. And it's already past my Thanksgiving already, so uh what was I doing again? Oh yeah. Let's go back to some quick games and we shall get um, two extra at least and continue on with the card pack. So first things first, I did want to check. Oh yeah, he is a small forward. So I am going to test Paul Pierce just to see if my uh, team still says balance. Or uh, will Par Pierce be an overpowered card in my team? All right, there he is. He is plus eighty one. Goddamn, he might be a little bit overpowered, but he does have that great offense. So we'll see how things work. All right, so let's let's fight Stuart. Even though he has those um, Spurs cards, but none of them would uh, have no competition against Paul Pierce. He'll totally wreck all those cards up. So I totally feel happy on that. Playmaking. Hmm. We'll go with Jeremy Lin. Alright, so there he is. He does call him Boris Dio. Defense. I'm going to call Paul Pierce. Nice. I'm liking this. Or it might be the reason why I got so weak cards was because uh, I heard somewhere where um you change your your card in NBA, it still keeps the same opponents for some reason until after this game. It was like. Um, it'll keep it more track of what you have now instead of what you had before. So let's continue with this. We get Dijon, Evan Brooks, Guex Smith, Joseph Nurker, Jeremy Grant. Noah Bonley, CJ Miles, Dorea Wright, and we get that playmaking coach. Alright, so I do need some boost. Jeremy Fredit, James Johnson, Cody Seller, Tony Snell, Brandon Rush. Oh, nice, super rare, OJ Mayo, and we it is another shooting card. 
And we do get another card that is uh, great at offense, but I already have too many offensive cards. I need more of um, athleticism and more of defense. So I wonder which, I know some positions like shooting, shooting guard and point guard, I think it is, where you can find more of the higher defense. But I don't know about uh, athleticism if that goes really high as the other stats. So let's continue on. We still have 40 more picks. And we get Clanthony early. Chase. Another Chase. Martel Webster. And we reach the car limit, of course. So we shall proceed. Let's go back. And we we do have extra cars to combine. Oh, nice! Look, I just pulled a super rare that I um I already have. I didn't even notice that I had them. So that's good news. That means I have um. If I do tend to play extra games, I would have these three ready for next season, which would be great. And plus, if I do end up winning the championships, I'll have a fourth extra card with the ultra rare. So that means I'll still need to find a fifth one to complete that strategy method that I've been working with all these seasons. Except for one of them where I actually lost that season. Where I only changed two cards instead of all five, and yeah, that was a uh, that was not good. I should have just stick with the same strategy. I thought if I only changed two, it would make a difference, and no, it didn't. I totally got wrecked. Like I didn't even pass the quarterfinals. So yeah, that was the only season that I had lost two, and yeah, after that, I had to like. Stay back on my consecutive victories of championships. And I'm still successful at that as I am going to my second consecutive now. It should be. Because I just won last one. And the, I, th I think this is my third one. I'm not sure. I got I got to check it out. It's been a while. So defense rebound. Mm, this might be a close one, but yeah, we do have that one. Playmaking athleticism, Jeremy Lin. Of course, he has good playmaking. He's a good car uh, overall. So yeah, I think that Paul Pierce is going to be a good addition in my team. He was a very, very good reward off the Bible Clash. So... Oh, dude, did I totally forget to train my car? Wow. To <laughs> that was totally a distraction. I apologize, you guys. But we just played an extra game for nothing. Okay, so let's go back to Manage Season. Oh, not Manage Season. Yeah, Manage Season. But I accidentally clicked the game recap. So you guys can tell this is how tired I am right now. I'm just making this video just because you know I was I was gonna drop it earlier, but then everybody came and it was like totally noisy and I there was no way I could make the video so I had to wait till everybody left and it seems I'm tired. I was gonna do this in the morning, but I might as well do it now because in the morning I don't think I have time to do this. And I'll probably release it later on tomorrow night. So I don't think that would be worth it. So let's filter by some comments. See what we could get. All right. Let's get all these guys. All right, that was it. So, it should get him about level 23. 
and he's looking already beast already. Even though that's not his real stats, that's his real stats right there. So it seems we already trained the commons and non commons. And so far, do we have any rare supports? Okay, we don't. And these cards, I am saving them up just because I always want to uh, finish the card catalog. I don't know what it's up with me and try to complete those kind of collections. That's just the way I am, and I'm gonna just keep staying that way, I guess. So let's go back with some quick games. All right. So let's face blue. Blue. It's not. It's not pronounced blue as in like the color. It's pronounced blue as in you know blowing away. So, offense, playmaking, Jeremy Lin. Even though Paul Pierce would have been a uh, would have been better, but I'm still working on this new team athleticism. I think Paul Pierce will really come in handy here. Yes, he does. So it seems like he's not really overpowered in my team. It's still keeping like the same. I'm still fixing like the same kind of cards, but yeah, I'm not seeing one overpowered card from the team. So if if it still keeps going this way, that yeah, this might be way more better, and I think I might even win more games than I usually do now. Because first, like I am using one card that's like more overpowered than the rest of my team and second I'm not even facing like no like no no uh, cards that match the stats of Paul Pierce so we do pull up another rare Dante Exum I don't think I have him because I am collecting the Jazz team catalog so far from the rare side and there's several other teams that I need to complete But from super rare, I mostly need like a lot more teams. And we do end up putting another rebound coach. Nice, nice. I do need more boost. Because my season should come in in about two days. So that won't take long. Alright. We get Troy Daniels. I think we put that card like to a board to go and we get an uncommon reset offense Reggie Bullock Wesley Johnson mascot I'm not gonna say his name <laughs> Will Benham Tyler Zetter Derek Williams Anthony Jeremy Grant and reach the car limit with Shannon Brown. So let's go back. Let's see if we have any new cars to combine. Oh, nice. So I think that should complete from the Jazz catalog. I still have to see if I still have an extra rare. So let's go uh, man the season. Let's go to Paul Pierce. Let's go to train. Alright, so let's train. Uh, should we train this guy or should I save him? So feed him? Yeah, I think I'll save. No, I'll just train him. Doesn't matter. So that should boost us up a, a little bit on the same level. We did not advance. No, it, it did not gain one level it just gained a little experience so with this it should guarantee to give him a uh, extra level all right I have more comments than expected there all right 
level 24, nice. And train us some more on comments. All right. Let's get all these guys. All right, so this is the last quick game. And we should finish up with the card pack opening. So yes, this will be our final game. And we should finish up the card pack opening as well. So hopefully I do end up putting something great. If not, that super rare did come in handy. Then it would indeed be our best pool out of those 65 cards. Well, 65 and extra from those extra games that we played. So look, we do face an overpowered card. He does have a legendary. So it must mean that his other cards are going to be weak. Not weak, but in a way they're not going to like even handle the cards that I'm going uh, to throw at him next. Like, he, he was a good card, but nowhere near Jeremy Lin's stats. So, rebound playmaking. Mm, that one is a close one, but no 300. Rebound playmaking. You guys can see another 300. And you see nowhere near above 250 from his rebound. So, that's not going to help him at all. So, yeah, you guys got to watch out for that. As one overpowered card could indeed make you lose matches. If used wrong. All right, so let's finish up these last eight picks, and this will be indeed our poly last board reset pool. So I don't think we'll be able to pull another one. We get our last two. Last one shall be right here. Oh, nope. Nothing good. So, yeah, just that super rare. <coughs> Excuse me. Was the best thing. And as far as that goes, uh, I still haven't pulled no ultra rare from the board. I know some of you guys have, and some of you guys are way up above me from the tiers. I think some of you shall be an epic or legendary, depending on uh, the rewards you guys got from the Rivals Clash, because, you know, that really helps, indeed, like, try to um, raise above the tiers, because with one legendary shall get you um, where I'm at right now, if I did indeed uh, try to aim for that Rivals Clash legendary. Fully trained would probably take me, um, probably maybe ultra plus plus, not that much, but depends on, um, how much, how much, like, how much, uh, the overall stats from your whole team is, and it calculates into your bar tier. But yeah, there is specific numbers into getting to the tiers, but I just don't know exactly how. I mean, exactly the numbers. So yeah, this is going to be our last two picks. Alright, so nothing great at all there. So I hope you guys enjoyed the card pack opening, and I really apologize for my voice that it sounded uh, so sleepy. Because it's late night, but hope you guys have fun. And I'll see you guys in the next one.